Hello everybody, welcome to the Danger Zone. This is Lance Danger speaking and this is day 4 of the 100 Days of Making Comics Challenge version 3. And I didn't get to do that much yesterday. Um, school has started and there's been a lot of reading to do, a lot of material to go over for my classes. So I didn't get to have as much time to work on stuff as I wanted to. I worked like maybe around 40, 40 some, 40 odd minutes probably doing stuff and I had to do it at school really in the library which is very convenient because I had, I have a couple, a bit of free time in between classes on certain days which I guess going to take advantage of if I don't have like too much to do I'll just, um, I'll just like do some at least minor stuff like at least like sketch pages out or do plotting or whatever so that's pretty much what I'm going to do to be able to keep up on the pace that I've been able to do so far now like today is my Friday pretty much so I'm going to have a nice little weekend to be able to catch up and do more stuff than I wanted to and here is what I have done. I have not colored it yet, but this is another strip of Stupid the Cat. And here is a more penciled in page of Exorcist, which is going to be inked pretty soon as well. So yeah, hopefully over the weekend I'll be able to uh, finally find the cable for the printer scanner to see if I can get that rolling so I can do full comic book pages for my web comics and work on other projects as well. I'm going to most likely do quite a bit of writing as well over the weekend. And I'm kind of also like thinking what I can do for my YouTube channel like I kind of want to revamp it, like revitalize it to an extent and I don't want it to become a little too stagnant. i always pushing myself to create something newer, to experiment a little more and I think I'm going to do that a little bit more. I want to kind of like reevaluate the content that I have on my page and yes like figure out like what to do like that will keep me motivated and interested in doing um, videos aside of course from the 100 days of making videos I've had other plans of doing different types of videos before like I have with me actually the original notebooks um, where I did the Mighty Warlord back in high school and I think I'm probably going to do maybe like a series of videos just showing off the each individual chapter or issue that I had done. It's the main run was 50 issues of the Mighty Warlord, and that's not including an issue number zero and a couple of mini series as well that I had done for that comic. So. That would be like an interesting material, I guess, if people want to see that, or I'll just probably do it to kind of just have like that out there documented that I did that. And also, I've been thinking about doing a kind of behind the scenes type thing of each individual chapter that I've done of Warlord that I've published online as well. Yes kind of do like a video commentary about it, like very similar to movies that have director commentary tracks and such so I think I might do that as well. I uh, definitely want to do more speed art uh, once I have my desk completely set up and uh, the camera completely set up. I definitely want to do that again. Those are always entertaining to me and of course I'm going to probably do um, re-edits of the mini trailers that I do for my web comics and projects so and I'm, of course I'm going to be doing more blogs another thing I've been thinking about is doing like 
video editorials based on previous blogs. I have written uh, truthfulcomics.com. I have written blogs there talking about comics that either influenced me or reviews. I, I haven't really done a review on YouTube in a very long time now. It's been probably a few years. It's been a while also that I've done that in blog form. So as a form of extending and branching out, I'm going to likely do that kind of stuff again and most likely do some videos of it as well. So um, I don't want this video to run too long. I'm going to cap it off here. Hopefully it'll be a very interesting and productive weekend for me. I hope you all have a very interesting and productive weekend as well. Um, I have nothing else to say except let's go Mets and day four, flawless victory.